Hello friends. So welcome to another video of our video series on Jetpack Compose. So in the previous videos, we have seen uh, the usage of this remember uh, function, which is available in Jetpack Compose. That how we can uh, use a state inside a composable, and uh, this state will never be reset to its its default value whenever this state example or this composable function will recompose. So this remember will help in remembering or caching the most recent value, which will be uh, whatever increment uh, it is done to this value on this button click. So uh, this remember is used for that purpose. Let me again give you an example. So when we click on this, we are we can see the change is happening over here. And uh, ideally what is happening is this whole function is recomposing. But this value is not resetting to its default value because of this remember. So remember is actually remembering the most recent value and not resetting it. Okay. So but there is one issue with this implementation. So now let's try to rotate our device. Okay. So as you can see, let me increase the size. As you can see, the value is reset back to zero. And if I again increment it and if I rotate it back, it is again uh, like reverted back to its initial value because whenever the orientation will be changed nothing will be this remember will not work okay this remember will uh, like clear itself whatever the value it had and it will reset the value to zero so uh, this is obviously a problem uh, with uh, the orientation or if you change the locale or anything that will recreate your activity okay so that's why this is happening. So to fix this, there's a, one more function similar to remember. So let's try using it. So let's, so this will be remember savable. Oh, remember savable. Yeah. Why this is not coming? Oh, my bad. Like this. So remember savable. What this will do is this will save the value and it will not clear it even if the orientation is changing okay so let's try first running this application so now let's try incrementing the value we've incremented it till 5 rotate the screen and it will save the value and now if we try to increment it again it will increment it after 5 only so let's see see up to 10 now let's rotate it back and now let's try to increment it again up to 15 it started from 10 so this is the way it actually works okay so remember savable will save the state even if your activities uh, is like recreated okay it will survive that thing it will survive orientation changes so that's when you should use remember savable but remember that you shouldn't blindly use it okay because obviously this will stay in the memory for long longer than just uh, remember okay if you are using this remember this will clear on a uh, rotation change so if you don't need any value on a rotation change you can use remember okay but if you need a value uh, if you need to uh, make sure that the value survives the rotation changes etc etc orientation changes etc so then you should actually be using remember savables. So uh, this is uh, one of the very powerful and useful thing. So in the previous, uh, like uh, if you are using XMLs and uh, just a traditional way of creating UI, then you have to do all that uh, save state thing. You have to put the bundle, you have to save it to the bundle. You have to get it uh, whenever, uh, your activity recreates or uh, orientation changes and you have to get the value from the bundle you have to set it to the text views or whatever views you are using so in this scenario you don't have to worry about any of that and it compose will handle that for you by just using this remember savable so this is making our developers life really really easy so make sure you uh, read more about this on the official developers doc uh, and uh, stay tuned for more videos. I'll be creating a couple of more videos on states and some other stuff revolving around states. 
so stay tuned to my channel do hit the subscribe button and bell icon for getting notified about future videos if you have any recommendations or anything you can simply uh, leave a comment below and i do read the comments uh, on a regular basis and i will try to uh, like resolve all your queries as quickly as possible so do hit the like button and share the video if you like it and stay tuned for more videos thanks take care bye bye